Hi everyone, Jeffrey K. Howard here, Vegas Film Critic, here to review Collide, starring Nicholas Hoult, Felicity Jones, Sir Ben Kingsley, yes, and Sir Anthony Hopkins. We have two actors who have been knighted Knights of the Round Table in this film. So how bad could it be? Little backstory on this movie, Relativity Studios went bankrupt. So this movie's been made a year or two. It's been sitting on the shelf and Open Road picked it up for distribution. So it's been seen in Europe. It's on video on demand in Europe and we're just getting it on the tail end here. And of course they didn't show it to critics. You know, they were, that's a reason... You know, they didn't want to spend the extra money on it, I guess, or Open Road didn't. Or, you know, sometimes they, it could be a bad film, but that doesn't mean they, when they don't show critics it's a bad movie. It's just that means that they bought it out of bankruptcy and they didn't want to spend any more money promoting it than they already had to, I guess. I'm not sure. So, yes, I know what you're saying. I went out and paid for this movie tonight, and I was one of three people in the movie theater. So that was encouraging. But, you know, hey, it is it is what it is. So, Nicholas Howe plays an American who is in Cologne, Germany, and... Uh, He's trying to make ends meet by working for a drug dealer played by Ben Kingsley, uh, who's just outrageous. I mean, Ben Kingsley, he's just, he's like a, a pimp drug dealer, okay? He's with all these beautiful women all the time. He's got gold Colt 45s going on. He's got these fur coats, and he's got this Armenian accent or some sort of weird accent going on, you know, and it's just like sexy beast, but just kind of like, you know, a, a European flair to it. And uh, so Nicholas Hout, he doesn't want to be a, a drug dealer anymore, okay? He doesn't want to do it. So he meets Felicity Jones at a bar one time, and uh, over a you know really shoddy kind of uh, montage sequence that lasts maybe a month or two, they fall in love. Then we find out that she has a real severe kidney condition. She needs a transplant. So he goes back to Ben Kingsley and says, look, I need to make some quick money. He goes, great, let's rip off my partner or my would-be partner that I've been with for the last 25, 30 years, Sir Anthony Hopkins, who's the big drug dealer in Germany. So what entails then is a plot to steal one of his trucks that has a major drug shipment in it. Lots of car chases. That's what I'm trying to tell you. We have lots of car chases. We're in Germany. And of course, what's really cool about this movie, and I'm not saying this is the greatest film in the world, but you know what? It's a really good B European action film. Remember Ronin? Remember with the... Uh uh, Robert De Niro, the car chases we had. That's the great John Frankenheimer. I'm not trying to say this is anything like Ronan, but it's got that European flair to it that I really liked. Uh, you know, all these car chases on these really windy roads in these small German villages. Uh, also on the Autobahn. I just thought that was such a great idea to see car chases on the Autobahn. And not to have computer effects, but full-scale cars flipping six or seven times over, major freeway carnage going on. I really enjoyed this more than I thought I would. Is it the greatest drug dealer movie? Absolutely not. Is it a Romeo and Juliet ripoff? Yes, it is. But you know what? To see Anthony Hopkins and Ben Kingsley share the screen together, yeah, uh, just like uh, Robert De Niro and uh, uh, what's the guy's name? Oh, uh, uh, Scarface. Al Pacino. It was like, what, that one movie Heat where they were just like five minutes together? Uh, but now we have these two great English actors, these knights of the round table, battling it out together throughout the whole movie. I think they have two scenes together. It's pretty cool. So, you know, go see it, really. You know, I've watched some other reviews on YouTube here and some other reviews on, on the internet, and they're just a little too harsh on it. I'm not. I just like the action in it. Nicholas Hout, I thought, was great. And, uh, you know, it's a really satisfying B-movie. If you want a great action film with just kind of a sliver, sliver of a story going on, but great characters uh, in terms of Anthony Hopkins and Ben Kingsley, I thought it worked. I really did. All right, for more reviews and interviews, just surf on over to my website at VegasFilmCritic.com. Also, if you like what you see, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, share. Uh, if you're watching on YouTube, if you're watching on television, go to the internet and get on YouTube and subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it. I'm Jeffrey Gay Howard in Las Vegas. I'll see you next time.